Welcome back to AIA the Somnium Files. My name is Jake. Last time we visited Mama and Mo, <laughs> our best friends. We got the call about Can I help 89 you? and we're at Sos Place. I need to ask you a few questions. I'm a very busy man. You can ask me tomorrow during normal business hours. It's about Shoko Nadami. You can't tell me you've never heard of her. As a matter of fact, I have. It was reported on the news that she was killed. Two days ago at 9.02 p.m., you made a phone call to Shoko Nadami. A phone call? I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. The bodyguard. So this is A. And this is B. Look, Date, your favorite cabaret girl is here. That's just a lantern. Rika isn't that sturdy. <laughs> Anything else in here? I like how the ways is visible from here. Got a girlfriend? Got a girlfriend? Dots. Didn't think so. Sorry, bud. I'm married. This guy's domestic. His normalcy must be punished by death. What's your name? What's your name? Mute my phone. Dots. What's your blood type? What's your blood type? Okay, I'll guess. You're a B. Definitely a B. You're being rude. I knew it. That attitude is so B of you. A is standing there. B is standing there. Your boss is a liar, you know. Your boss is a liar, you know. Aren't all politicians? That's surprisingly honest how much do you get paid hey how much do you get paid what i'm talking about cash my friend i wrapped my thumb against my pointer finger dip in a circle probably double what you make really iva bring up a job search website on it why are you wearing sunglasses at night don't those sunglasses make it hard to see that's i made a face at him no reaction. I guess you really can't see well in those. Date, perhaps there's something you should be using. Oh, that. That. So much blood. Where's all this red coming from? It's a thermograph. Yeah, I knew that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, he's lying. How do I get him to admit it? What will make so confess he killed Shogo? So, I guess we can do these other things first before doing call him. I think that's how we get him to admit phone call, not sure about. Kill. <laughs> Maybe you have met him before. Bribing. I'll give you one million yen for the truth. Only one million. Only? That's the kind of world he lives in. Peel off his nails. I should get some pliers and take his nails off. I thought that wasn't your style. Threaten him with your gun. Maybe I'll pull out my gun. That would result in heavy disciplinary action. Call him. Iba, call his phone again, using Shoko's line. Understood. You're not gonna pick it up? It's from Shoko. I had her give you a call. What? 
It'll stop ringing soon. Three, two, one. See? Fine. I did call her. Around nine o'clock, just like you said. Finally confessing? There's nothing to confess. I did nothing wrong. Then why did you lie to me? Uh, I'm a float. It's the mic again. <laughs> Accident. Because I didn't want to get involved in all of this nonsense. You mean to tell me that I am a suspect? Guts. My call was after Shoko died. If I were the killer, why would I do that? I don't know, but I'm asking the questions. Do you have a warrant? Guts. I thought not. I'll be leaving now. Good night, detective. So went back inside his mansion. I tried to follow, but so's bodyguards blocked my path. Go home, unless you want to get kicked out. What's the relationship between so and Shoko? I don't know. Even if I did, it would be confidential. About so's alibi. Do you know where So was Friday at 5 p.m.? Here, in the mansion. Can anyone corroborate that? Maybe the housekeeper. Why does So have her phone? I don't know what you're talking about. Look, a UFO. Look, a UFO! Don't, he didn't flinch. Look, the Mothman. Look, the Mothman! Don't, he didn't flinch. Look, a grandma. Look, a grandma! Don't. Didn't flinch. Look, a porno mag on the floor. Look, a porno mag on the floor. Where? I like this guy. Anything suspicious about so lately? No, nothing special. Not any different from any other politician, anyway. Do you know Shoko Nadal? I've heard of her, but I've never met her. I saw her on the news. Date, a minute. What happened? So is on the move, most likely in a car. How do you know? I hacked So's smartphone and I'm currently tracking the GPS. Not his rental phone, the one registered under his name. Where is he headed? Unknown, somewhere to the east. Just keep tracking him. Roger that. Can you do that from anywhere or do you need to be close? That hacking thing? Harbor Fair Warehouse District, Sunday, 8.51 p.m. Deja vu. So doing here. Date, my apologies. What's wrong? Oh no, not the batteries. <laughs> my battery is low. Are you serious? Dot. I guess it's not going to be a problem. I can still see. I can s still see out of my right now. My vision helped, and I went into warehouse. What will we find underneath? Maybe Renju? That would be pretty damning evidence against. So. I wonder what we will miss because we don't have. Like for 
narrative reasons. There will happen something that will that's will miss. Although he still uh, it can't be. Oh, oh yeah, frozen iris. Iris. Right, I uh... Oh yeah, I can't call because Iba, what's your charge? Currently at two percent. Can you make a call? I can. I am connected to the power supply. What do you hurry? Just connect me to boss. Date, what's wrong? Maybe something will happen to the body while we are away. I found a body. What? She was murdered. Multiple stab wounds to the back and one eye missing. Oh no. Location is Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. The victim, the victim is Iris Sagan. Iris? I'll tell you more later. Just send CSI to the scene right away. And one more thing. Huh? Congressman So Sejima, bring him to Abyss. I'll take responsibility for everything. Just do it, please. Dots. Dots. All right. Dots. Because sometime real soon, I'm going to die. God damn it! Police headquarters, Sunday, nine forty-eight p.m. Do you honestly think you can get away with this? Funny, I was gonna ask you the same thing. Date, calm down. You know Iris Sagan, don't you? No, I don't. I've never heard of her. Maybe he's lying, maybe he's not. But even if he doesn't know her name. Uh, can I... Yeah, I can look at this. Iris's body was found frozen in the warehouse. Her right eye was removed, and she suffered multiple stab wounds to her back. There were no other visible wounds on her body, so the stab wounds were likely the cause of death. From the size and shape of the marks, the murder weapon is almost definitely a knife. Possibly a kitchen knife. Thinking about how Iris's body was frozen when I discovered it, it must have taken at least 18 hours for the body to freeze to that state. I entered the warehouse at 9 p.m. 18 hours prior to that was 3 a.m. And she left with someone. Then. Iris was last seen alive around 2 a.m. She was live streaming, so there's no doubt about the time. Meaning Iris must have been murdered between 2 and 3 in the morning. Iris's body was discovered in Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse in the warehouse district by the harbor. Okiura Fishery? That caught my eye too, but we'll get to that later. The actual murder site is unknown. The lack of blood at the scene makes it highly likely that she was killed somewhere else. Iris was live streaming until 2 a.m. today. Someone visited her and interrupted the stream. I hadn't been in contact with her for a while. Whoever visited her this morning almost certainly has something to do with the murder. This is the image stored in the Persons of Interest database. I saw So walking out of the cold storage warehouse where the corpse was discovered. Iba recorded the whole thing. Just before my battery ran out. Mm -hmm. So we'll show this. What? Even though So doesn't know Iris. Well, I guess we can show her the picture. 
Really, yeah. Just because he, he came out of the warehouse doesn't mean he looked at the underneath the cloak. Maybe he, has, he was doing something else. But yeah, we. We'll, I think you could show that he was coming out of the place where she was dead. I put a picture of Iris in front of so. So you've never met her before? I have not. Have you seen her corpse? Corpse? I know you've seen her body. Based on what? Iris's body was found at Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. What does that have to do with anything? Uh, I wonder if you would have gotten an achievement if you showed everything correct. Oh well. I stood up and went to the corner of the room. I picked up the PC monitor and put it on the desk in front of him. This. Iba, play the video. Right away. See. Then I suppose you know I was there. Then you saw the body. I didn't. I was at the warehouse, but I didn't see any corpses there. Don't lie to me. It's the truth. Then what were you doing there? Dutch. Dutch. I choose to remain silent. You what? Remain silent, as is my right, guaranteed by law. <sighs> Remember that I am a politician. I know my rights. Dots. Dots. Date, can I get a second? What? Does it matter if he saw the body or not in this case? He's a busy man. If we hold him here too long... You want me to stop beating around the bush? I certainly do. You believe that Sosajima is her killer, or is at the very least involved in the crime somehow. Yeah, I lean towards the second. Yeah. Why not ask him for his alibi first? I need to know Zoe's alibi for um, Let's look at this again So probably for this Guess Iris was killed sometime between 2 and 3 in the morning do you have an alibi for that time? I was playing Mahjong all night at a place called Dora Dora in Shinjuku. Politicians spending all night in a Mahjong parlor. An exclusive Mahjong parlor, yes. <laughs> it's Mahjong, you should have had three opponents with you. Indeed I did, but they were all strangers. I don't remember their names. Mm -hmm. Date, I did some research. Dora Dora is a private room Mahjong parlor. It is owned and operated by one individual. If the rooms are private, that limits the number of potential witnesses. The shopkeeper might be in So's pocket. He's the only one we could ask about So's alibi. Especially if he doesn't remember any of the three people he played against. He might as well not have an alibi. That's not much of an alibi, So. Please, this is ridiculous. First you suspect me in the matter of Shoko Nadami, and now this? In murder mysteries, not having an alibi is the same as having an alibi. I haven't killed anyone. Not Shoko, not Iris. Besides, if I stabbed a woman, why would I bring her to a cold storage warehouse? Because usually it goes like the killer wants to wants to have an iron proof, iron clad alibi. So it became, they try to make it seem so tight that it seems like suspicious if they have everything like from minute to minute where they were and what they have done and etc. While normal normal people will just say where were you? If someone asks where were you last Saturday at two would you say I was home, I was out drinking, I don't remember where at that time. 
something like that. Wait, what did you say? Mm. Did we say that she was stabbed? That's so didn't respond, but I remember he slipped up. If I stabbed a woman, so does know about the corpse because autopsy. I never mentioned Iris's cause of death. How do you know she was stabbed? Maybe he will try to play it out as I just assumed she was stabbed. Because, because you did it? Don't be stupid. Then how do you know? Stop dodging the question and answer. Dot, dot. Boss, give me permission to sink. He can't hide inside his own head. Dot. You've got it. Sink with him. Didn't we have to have permission? I put so into chemically induced sleep. But do not worry. It will not affect the sink. Okay, Dante. Let's do it. Right. Please, don't forget the six-minute time limit. <sighs> you say it every time. Let us begin. Maybe we'll have time for this if we're fast. Not how physics were. Did you witness my superior driving technique? Yes. Yeah, I saw you get in an accident. No, I only pressed the wrong pedal. That's what you call an accident. Oh, look at that. Don't change the subject. Observe the surroundings. Huh, in a word, I'd say it's strange. Yeah, there's Iris. Maybe this is So's corrupt nature manifesting itself. The man's Somnium is almost as corrupt as he is. I am impressed. Uh, never mind. Yeah, this is a real bad dream. Let's get the clues we need and get the hell out of here. It's Iris. What on earth is she doing here? Are she? Uh. Hmm. Iris! We can't go any closer? We cannot. That silhouette we saw. This is so Somnium. During a sink, we experience the subject's dreams from a third person perspective. In other words, it has to be him. Why would hmm, why would he dream about himself as big? Uh, a silhouette, like for example in Mizuki's Somnium, Mizuki was Mizuki herself, and and in the other timeline, the other road we saw uh, that there was a silhouette looking at the scene. In Iris' Somnium, the previous time. And this time, actually, there were. This time, there were two silhouettes. No, not this time. We haven't done it in this time. <laughs> in the last timeline, the second try, we saw two silhouettes. One looking at the killing and one doing the killing. I cannot say for certain. 
but probably. Yeah. We shouldn't assume things. What's going on? It appears that time is looping in this warped space. Time is looping? Can't you do something about that? What exactly do you propose I do? You're telling me I have to watch this scene over and over? I don't want to watch it either. Well then? I suppose we can help her. We may then be able to ask this manifestation of Iris some questions. Huh? That's... Sure, do whatever you gotta do. Yes, we have to save Iris, no matter what. Yeah. But to do that, we gotta do something about that huge wooden box. Somnium scan! Activate! If this was Twitch chat, you could spam tokens. <laughs> good old, good old crash. Uh. Thank God. You gotta be end this episode here and finish this in the next one. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Bye.